So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in device manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna expand universal serial bus controllers. Now, if you see anything here that says like generic USB hub or just anything similar to that, you want to update the driver for it. Now to do that, let's say that this says generic USB hub or anything that's a bit similar to that. Then you wanna right click on it and then click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers. Make sure that you have the best drivers for device installed. You want to repeat this for everything that says generic USB hub. And if you see any of the USBs right here that you think may be causing a problem, then you want to update those drivers as well. See if that works for you. If that's still not working, then for the second method, you want to head over to search and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you want to type in msdt.exe space full slash id space device diagnostic and click on enter. And now this will come up. You want to click on next. Wait for this to load. And if you get a message like this, you want to click on enable. Wait for this to load. And then once the troubleshooting is being completed, see if that works for you. If that's still not working, another thing you could try is you could head over to search and type in device manager again. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you want to expand universal serial bus controllers. Then you want to find the USB that you're having a problem with. You can now right click on it and then click on uninstall. You can then uninstall it. Once you uninstall your USB, you then want to restart your computer and then Windows will automatically install it again. See if that works for you.